everyone, this is Jane here from Crystal Sparkles Readings. I'm just here to pop down a card of the day for you and um, just have a little look and see what the tarot deck has in store for us for a little bit of guidance for the day. Um, I won't be here tomorrow, so this card is going to cover, or these couple of cards are going to cover today and tomorrow. And they'll kind of take you into Wednesday as well because I probably won't post anything until later on wednesday sort of afternoon time so well, let's just have a little look and see what we've got a little shuffle okay so just using the Faulkner black and white deck as usual for our daily guidance and the card that I've got for us today is the king of pentacles um, now the king of pentacles is a really interesting card um, it's as you know if you've listened to me or watched me before king the pentacles are all about kind of earthy stuff material goods um, all of that kind of thing you know money jobs business finances all of that stuff they tend to cover that okay and the kings are the powerful man in the pack really so they are kind of saying um they're talking about power they're talking about people that have made it people that have got somewhere achieved their goals powerful energy okay when we're talking about a reading they often come through and talk about earth sign gentlemen when i'm looking at the card for the day though what they're kind of what the energy of this is is very much um that your hard work will get you recognized and get you achieved and it will get you the things that you want um okay so it is it is about stuff really in a lot of cases with the pentacles which is just just what they talk about um but it's also talking about being grounded being in the world so lots of things like cleaning um, gardening, eating, making food, baking, cooking, all those stuff, all of that comes in with the pen, with the pentacles. Um, so it can be saying to you that it's a day where you need to get into your body and get grounded rather than being too sort of, air, I, I almost want to say airy fairy, but I don't mean that in a bad way. Um, you know, sometimes when we can, when we're when we're spiritual, we can kind of drift off into a little world sometimes. Um, and this, these, these pentacles cards say, come on, that's fine, but you need to have a balance and you need to also be grounded. So you could find yourself today wanting to, I can't imagine where anybody would want to do some cleaning. Um, but you might feel drawn to doing some, you know, really kind of getting your earthiness back, put your feet on the earth. You might feel drawn to going outside, putting your feet on the grass or actually physically putting your feet on the earth. It's very grounding the um, pentacles cards and the kings are powerful in that so okay so it could be saying to you that that's what needs what is needed for today um but it does also talk about you getting what you deserve and what you've worked hard for okay so you could find yourself you know in the office with the boss having a conversation about being promoted having a pay rise all of those sort of things come in with the king of pentacles um what i'm going to do is i'm going to put down two tarot cards today i don't normally put down two but i will put down two today because I, I won't be around tomorrow so i'm going to just pop down another one to have a little look and see okay so the other card the other tarot card that i've got is the death card now okay so this is our energy for today and this is our energy for kind of tomorrow going into wednesday um kind of don't freak out about the death card you know quite a lot of people there are cards that people freak out about in the tarot the death cards one the devil's another um as you know if i've if you've listened to me before watched my stuff before you know um that i don't feel like there are any cards really in the tarot to freak out about um so the death card talks about kind of it, it kind of thing it talks about it's really hard to describe 
it's almost like transformation that's the way i always look at it you know when your butterfly goes in your little caterpillar goes into his chrysalis and he comes out a butterfly it's that kind of transformation so there is an element of letting go of something involved that you might feel a bit uncomfortable about okay but what replaces it is better and what replaces it is something that takes you on your journey in the right direction so it might be that things that have been hanging around you getting in your face and kind of um you know just generally holding you back are leaving the, the, those things are late are leaving you and you are moving into a time where actually what you have around you is a lot better for you and you feel better for it so although sometimes that letting go of things i mean I, i'm not a big fan of endings don't like them at all um but the these the death card talks about things leaving that are no good for you okay so they're things that are needing to be gone you know really really needing to be gone um so kind of don't freak out too much this is all for the good you know it's all for the greater good um i'm just going to pop down ooh, what should i do should i put down oracle should i put down angel i think i'm going to put down oracle okay so i'm going to put down an oracle card to go with these lovely lovely tarots for the next couple of days and just see what the oracle cards have to add to the scenario okay well interesting because that is the man holding the coin and the man holding the coin actually is the equivalent of the king of pentacles so he really could not make it up could you um so they're kind of just reiterating to you all of those messages okay um the guy with the coin i kind of really like him because he's he's sort of just he's so so relaxed and chilled out and he's kind of there with his money and he's happy and he's he, there's no stress around him he just feels his face looks very relaxed he looks quite chilled out um you know his environment looks looks good it looks like there's um you know a lovely harvest going on behind him you know the the, the ground behind him the um countryside behind him is very um abundant it looks very abundant so this is what this card is talking about really it's talking about abundance and it's talking about all of that good stuff so the appearance in, with the death card in amongst that in this spread can be saying to you you need to be letting go of the stuff that is not benefiting you okay so if you focus on the stuff around you that is the things around you that is the people that are the things that bring you joy the things that move you forward focus on those and and really kind of just let go of anything that does not fit that bill you know anything that's not bringing you joy anything that is not um it's not feeling good to you feels uncomfortable it's bringing you stress you know look at him he's proper chilled out um so i would say to you anything that doesn't give you that feeling the cards are asking you to think about maybe letting that go okay and moving forward into a time where you've got more good things around you good people around you good energies around you so that you don't need to kind of feel the stress and all of that stuff that goes with um people that or people and things that don't really not really moving you forward um i will leave that with you for the day for today um as i said i won't be here tomorrow but i should be back on wednesday to do a little bit more um with you um i've got a couple of videos that i need to film and upload um on new decks to have a look at some little mini reviews and card box openings and stuff like that so i'm hoping to get those up this week um i did manage to get one up last week so if you haven't seen it have a look on my youtube channel um which is crystal sparkles if you go there and subscribe to that you can get access to those like bot card unopenings i've got lots of reviews and things to do lots of little tutorials in the mix coming soon um so please do tune in and subscribe to that because that they're, they're they're quite fun um i'll leave those things with you have a good couple of days and i'll be back again on wednesday bye for now